Oh, yes, I can. Nicolot! Oh. To the victor, the spoils. <laughs> Who knows how it has to be? Not some old miser hoarding my chastity, listing his lady as though she were some kind of a chattel. It's unnatural. I need a strong, true fighter who'll willingly tilt for me. Not some poor flower who'll suddenly wilt when he's hard pressed. Right in the thick of the battle. Oh, oh, for a night, for my night, so. Oh, for a night, for my night, so. Oh, for a night, for my night. I don't want a pot-bellied soak who's glued to the flagon when he should be up there facing the dragon. Oh, my man must have an aim that is steady, keeps his head in, soon cross my drawbridge, disproving the fallacy that there's no lover can cross my portcullis. He'll mount and Find that this lady is ready Oh, oh for a night for my night so oh, oh, for a night for my night so oh, oh, for a night for my night It's one of a girl's basic rights Oh, oh for a night for my night One thing I don't need is an employee with an attitude. Well, the point is now, Jill, that I need a job fast. Do you know what an escort service is? Cachet for the discriminating gentleman. Are you running what I think you're running? A business. A business that could get you seven years in jail. You would ruin careers. The family lives of those men, powerful men. If you take Sidney Barrows down, then you're going to take every one of those men along with her. Mayflower Madam, the true story of Sidney Biddle Barrows, Tuesday at 9.30 on One. The film on offer tomorrow night is the second part of Phantom of the Opera, completing the sad story of the masked composer living in self-imposed solitude beneath the Paris Opera House. That's tomorrow at 8.35. The Royal Albert Hall doesn't boast such a character as far as I know, but of course it does revel in the tradition established by Sir Henry Wood, the proms. Tomorrow, Yo-Yo Ma plays Dvorak's cello concerto in B minor with the BBC Symphony Orchestra, and that's followed by the Berlioz Te Deum, all under the baton of Gennady Rostyestvinsky. There are no seats left for this performance. The only tickets available are promenade and gallery, but of course it can be heard on Radio 3 starting at half past seven. A look at the weather now. Thundery showers affecting parts of the southeast, East Anglia, the Midlands and the Pennine region will slowly die out tonight. Most areas becoming increasing, increasingly cloudy and misty with local fog patches by dawn. The far northwest will have periods of more persistent drizzle overnight. Many parts of the country will start cloudy tomorrow, but away from coastal districts this cloud should burn off during the morning to allow some hazy sunshine. There will be a few scattered showers, mainly in central and southeast regions later. It'll be another hot and humid day in much of England and Wales, though some coastal districts will stay dull and foggy and consequently cooler. Western Scotland will also be a little cooler. Now the time is 24 minutes to 2 and it's time for us to go, but Radio 1 is on the air with Alan Freeman's Saturday Rock Show until 2 o'clock. And on Radio 2, there's company throughout the night. At the moment, it's Night Ride with Colin Berry. Thank you for joining us, and on behalf of everybody here in the BBC Television Centre, this is Malcolm Einan wishing you a very good night. <laughs>